In this video, I'll show you how to copy down an existing Drupal site from Acquia Cloud to your Acquia Cloud IDE. The first thing that we'll do is we will click the Copy from Acquia Cloud button that's in the Welcome documentation. That pops open a new terminal, and it runs a command for you automatically. It asks you, do you want to clone a project into the current directory? It's asking that because I don't have one here yet, and I'm going to answer yes. You can see that it's automatically detected which application to pull from, and it asks me which environment I'd like to copy things from. Dev, a pipelines environment, my RA environment, or stage. And you can see it says the name of the branches that are checked out to each of those environments. I'm going to choose the stage environment, which has a branch named Drupal 9 checked out to it. And the first thing it's going to do is clone that Git repository to my IDE and check out that branch. Next, it's going to ask me, since I have more than one database on this site, which database I would like to copy. I'm going to choose the default database, which is named EEM Grasmic, and it is going to dump a copy of that from the remote server, download it to this server, and import it. Next, it copies down all of the files that are in the public files directory for that upstream site. And finally, it automatically detects that I'm using Composer by seeing that I have a Composer JSON file, and it runs Composer install to ensure that I have the vendor directory and all of the other dependencies that I need to run this Drupal site. Let's take a look at it. I can go to the menu item, Open Drupal Site, and click to open the site in a new tab, and you can see that I have a fully working Drupal 9 site that I'd copied from my Acquia Cloud environment. Type in my username and password, log in, and I'm ready to start site building immediately. If I click back to the IDE tab, I can open files, write code, and run commands on the terminal.